Hello? May I come in? Um, sure. Amelia. Ah! No one can know we're here. Who can know we're here? No one. I mean, everyone. Everyone can know we're here. Everyone can't know. No one can know. No one can know. We're here. Who's here? We are. I just said that. And no one can know. Exactly. Sit down. I already am. That was painfully slow. My stress levels are high, but I'm putting it behind me. Who are you? What is your name? Why do you look so much like me? And why are you so smartly dressed? Mm. Thank you. It's suspicious. I am not suspiciously dressed. I'm appropriately dressed. For what? My job. Which is what? Amelia, I'm gonna tell you something. Actually, no, my priorities have changed. Instead of being worried about the dress code, I'm more worried about the face code. Why do you look so much like me? Oh, uh, and this one is suspicious. Well, I was- Oh my goodness, are you my long lost twin? Please tell me you're my long lost twin. That would be so cool. Um, no, actually, I- Dolly the Sheep 2.0! Uh, no, Amelia 2.0. The Sheep? Called Dolly? What am I talking about? Cloning. Are you a clone? I'm not a clone, per se. I'm actually from another universe. You're an alien. No. Oh. I'm not anything out of space like that. Oh. I understand. I really don't think you do. You're not an alien, like, out of space. I get it. You're like Loki on the ground, like a mythical creature kind of thing, like a fairy or a vampire. I'm not a fairy. You're right, a fairy would never dress like that. Definitely a vampire. I'm not a vampire. Okay. What was that? What was what? That look. What look? That look you just gave me. That was no look. You just did it again. I'm not a vampire. Sure. <sighs> Can I please continue with what I'm saying? It's very important. I am from another universe, a parallel universe. There are infinite parallel universes, therefore, there are infinite versions of you, me, us. So that is why I'm a highly intelligent secret agent and you're- Whoa, 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 whoa. Did you just say secret agent? Because that sounds awesome. With so many different versions of you, it's inevitable that some will have different personalities, different jobs, which is why I am a top secret agent. Oh, you're a top secret agent now. And you're not. Right, so basically what you're saying is, you're cooler than me. Well, I wouldn't disagree with the statement. Me neither. The reason I'm talking to you today is because in my universe, we've developed the idea and the technology to take all the different Amelias what? from all the different... What, what is this? What, what is what? what? This. What, what is this? This is me taking all the different Amelias and putting them in this universe. This one right here! No, I'm, I'm talking about my universe. Wh which is where? It, well, it's, it's here. It's here! Well, it's everywhere. It's, it's besides the point. Please, can I just finish? So we are recruiting the best and most trustworthy Amelias. <laughs> what now? Sorry, I just find it funny you talking about me in plural. I'm just picturing it. Loads of little me's. Little Amelias running around, one foot high, scrambling for this evidence for this top secret mission. Frantically throwing papers over their head, like that SpongeBob episode. <laughs> Sorry, do continue. As I was saying, we are looking for the best of the best out of the Amelias. The kind, the good-hearted, no thieves, no murderers, no liars, no traffic wardens. What, what for? Our top secret mission. Gruel, how do you test that? A questionnaire, for you. A quiz. And what if I'm not what you're looking for? What do you mean? Well, if I was a thief or a traffic warden. You're a traffic warden? No, no, I'm not. I'm just saying, what if I was? <sighs> Don't play with me like that, boy. I'm female. If you're not what we're looking for, well, you already know quite a lot of information. Like you being a vampire. Let's just say it wouldn't end well for you. What? <gasps> Is that a threat? Question one. Okay. Favorite color. Translucent. Best creature, real or imaginary? Axolotl. 
Thoughts on a robotic apocalypse. Inevitable and exciting. Why so annoying? What? Sorry, uh, if you were to glue something together, what would you use? Marmite. Would you agree that penicillin is the best discovery in your history? Uh, no. Fridges with the crushed ice in the door. Like, with the big cubes and the little cubes. How many times have you given a parking ticket? None. Good. God, I hate traffic wardens. Uh, what's your opinion on garlic? Well, I think it would very much complement a chicken, barley and vegetable stew. Why do you ask? Just curious. Problem? No, I am just extremely allergic. Here's some water to settle it down. Thanks. That water's very special to me. Uh-huh. It's holy water. <coughs> Problem? No, I just uh, swallowed it down the wrong hole. <coughs> ah, right. <coughs> okay, I... <coughs> anyway, <coughs> will you stop? Sorry, what is all this supposed to mean anyway? The garlic, the holy water? Well, this is my opinion, yes. Something that I've thought of from early on in this strange encounter. Yeah. Which makes it my opinion on said encounter. Yeah. So therefore, I'm going to say my opinion. Okay. From what I've thought of. Right. On this said encounter. Please do. <sighs> and my opinion which I have thought- Oh my goodness. Oh, hold on. Text message. Sorry. Get on with it. Get on with what? Your opinion. My opinion on what? I don't know, you haven't told me yet. It was your opinion on something you said you thought of from the start of the encounter. Oh yeah, my opinion on something that I thought from the start of the encounter, right. I'm almost certain that you're a vampire. Wait, wait a minute, are those parking tickets? Maybe not. Are you a traffic warden? Are you a vampire? <laughs>